Welcome to God's Own TV. Almighty God, we grant your request. This is your boy. We're at the Guardian Tomb right now. Um, and that's the entrance to the Guardian Tomb. Uh, I've promised you that we'll keep sending you love and blessings. The prayer point for here is very simple. That as Jesus went in as a lamb, he came out as a lion. He would fight your battles for you as a lion in Jesus' name. Gospel filmmaker and actor, Damilola Mike Bamiloye, has eulogized Pastor Leki Adeboya as he celebrates his birthday. Pastor Leki Adeboya is the last son of the general overseer of the redeemed Christian Church of God, Pastor Enoch Adeboye. Describing him as an example of humility and a shining light, Damilola said he has been an inspiration to him, even without knowing it. In his words, Dear Pastor Leka, on this special day, I want to wish you a very happy birthday and express my gratitude to God for your life. Your example of humility is a shining light that we can all learn from and aspire to emulate. Even without realizing it, you have been a source of inspiration to me, and your passion for kingdom expansion has challenged me to do greater things for God. Your drive for excellence in the work of the Lord is truly inspiring, and I am grateful for your commitment to saying yes to his call. Damilola Mike Bamiloye went on to pray for the celebrant, praying for more strength, favor, and greater impact in the kingdom. He said, as you celebrate another year of life, I pray that the Lord will continue to bless you, renew your strength, and expand your territory. May his grace and favor be upon you always. Once again, happy birthday, dear brother. May this year be filled with joy, peace, and greater impact for the kingdom of God. Recall that Pastor Lique Adeboye has shared moments from his pilgrimage journey to Israel, which coincide with his birthday. And of course, if there's anything that is dead in your life, you would come alive in the mighty name of Jesus. You would also receive good news. Good news as he brought good news when he came. And the angel that sat on top of the uh, stone, from now on, anyone that is trying to roll back what God has given you permanent victory over, would lose in Jesus' name because the angel is going to sit on it 